Hi, this is April. Welcome back to my channel. I've recently discovered that there are a lot of visually impaired photographers out there. I'm not the only one. And I had noticed that Sony in the a7 IV and the a7C Mark II, they've implemented some accessibility features for people with low vision, which I thought was really a great step in the right direction. They have a screen reader that is able to read in the menu system, but once you get out to take a photograph, it doesn't read any of the ISO or shutter speed or any of that information. But I am really impressed that they took the initiative to implement a screen reader. Menu screen set up. Accessibility. Accessibility. Screen reader one slash one. Screen reader on. Button. Delete button in camera guide. Menu button back. Screen reader, screen reader, one, screen reader, off. I noticed that on YouTube, a lot of the camera reviewers sort of snickered at the concept of needing low vision accessibility features. Accessibility, this is, this is interesting. I didn't even know this existed, but check this out. I'm going to turn this on, and it's going to start reading everything. So basically, there, if you want, if you're lonely and you want someone to talk to you, uh, she will talk to you. I'm assuming that this is for people that have a hard time seeing. And some people may be like, "Well, why are you a photographer if you can't see?" Well, some people just don't see that well, and they can't see, but they can look through the the, the camera, and this thing will tell them all of the information. That's an interesting mode. Uh, we won't be using that most likely. Uh but there are many people out there with enough vision to be able to appreciate taking a photograph but we have issues seeing fine detail. So reading on a screen is not always super easy without magnification. And I don't think they understand that. The screen reader is a great idea. I'm really impressed that Sony decided to implement some of these accessibility features. And the only issue is, is that the screen reader only reads the menu, but when you're out in the main screen taking a photo, it doesn't tell you what the shutter speed is or the ISO or your aperture. What I would like to suggest to companies like Sony is to have where you can have the ISO and the shutter speed and aperture actually read to you as you are turning the dial. I think that would be phenomenal. One tip that I have for my fellow visually impaired photographers, besides saving your settings in your camera before you venture out, is on some of the newer Sony cameras, if you hit the display button four times, it'll give you a display like this. And it makes it much easier to see your settings. And I know there's people out there with other physical challenges that could use accessibility features such as how to hold the camera if you have use of only one hand or if you have paralysis or weakness. There has to be alternative ways to be able to operate the camera. And I just think it's very impressive that Sony took that step in the right direction. But I really would love it if they would go the next step and have the screen reader read the settings as you're actually turning the dials. I think that would be phenomenal. There's so many people out there with varying degrees of visual impairment. They might not be legally blind or anything, but it's still hard for so many to read the screen, especially when the LCD screens are pretty small. If you like this video, give it a like. Consider subscribing for more photography-related content from a newbie like me. God bless.